It is the last weekend of a pilot program near the U of M campus that was designed to deter crime. Barricades went up on two blocks in the heart of Dinky Town that created pedestrian only areas. Campus safety hoped they would see crime dip during this three week trial. WCCO's Mary Elmo's went to Dinky Town tonight to see if students and neighbors saw results. I think it seems to be better without, I guess, people driving by. One block on 14th Avenue and another on 5th have been blocked off for pedestrians only for the past three weekends. The hope was to cut down on drive by crimes and drag racing. All the U of M students that we spoke with agree that these barricades showed results. Shootings and muggings and some of the more severe crimes have definitely dropped. I would definitely prefer it. I do think that crime has been down in the area, but I don't think that this was an effective way to do that. Tessa Bullock thinks this is just a Band-Aid solution and wants something more reliable. I feel like crime could have been down better if like just like cops were around more. Bullock says these barricades make this area less accessible. It's just been like difficult to get around here now. Yeah. And I feel like these businesses could be struggling because like their people can't come through. We reached out to several of the businesses on these two blocks and did not get a response. But it was clear that there was still foot traffic for the restaurants and bars within these barriers. The U of M says they've also added more blue lights around campus, which immediately connects you to a 911 dispatcher. It's taken us to a way better place than where we were. I guess it worked somewhat, but I'm excited for these to be gone. These barricades are going to go away on Sunday, but since the program is still ongoing, the U of M doesn't have statistics to provide us yet, but they say they do plan to collect feedback from business owners, students, and neighbors. Reporting in Dinkytown, Marielle Mose, WCCO 4 News. At the end of this month, the U of M is offering a free self-defense class for students, faculty, and staff. We have shared that link to register on WCCO.com.